Which one of the 37 Qurans? Which one of the 37? Which one of the 37 Qurans is the right one? Which one of the 37 is the right one? Which one of the 37 is in heaven? Which one of the 37 is in heaven? So here we have Sahih International. Which one of the 37 is in heaven? Idiot. And there's 37 different versions in Dubai today. 37. Which one is Apple Baka? Which one is Apple Baka? Apple Baka, yeah. Show me all the 37 Qurans that are different. Number two, they are dialects, they are different. When you see, no, I'll give you an example. I'll give you an example. When you look at Fatha, so, so your scholars are so stupid they cannot come, they cannot translate Arabic into English without making mistakes. Your scholars, yes, the, the people are that, that stupid, they cannot convert Arabic into English without making it different things. No, you, it's just a hook. It's just lying. You are lying. You've been lied to. You've been lied to. You've been lied to. Because they would. They would what are the dialects for Surah 3 verse 146 since gentleman says Surah 3 146, okay. Different, different Arabs speak Arab differently, but they can all read the same Arabic. Why are we arguing? I haven't seen a uncivilized because this book is uncivilized. This book is not civilized, therefore Muslims are not civilized. When was the last time a Christian converted to Christianity in this part? Because this Christians don't convert to Christianity. Okay, let's have a look. Many times people have come here. Okay, so let's have a look at this. Two versions of the Quran. Okay, Hafs version and Kalun and the Barsh versions. Okay, one version has that many are prophet as four, yes. right? Mm -hmm. The other version has that many... You're all going to be killed for being apostate. No one's going to be killed. The, the other version has... The other version has... The other version has... Pussy doesn't work, work like that. Pussy doesn't work like that. Yes, it does. If I leave Islam and I'm, and I'm, and I'm talking yes. about it, I'm leaving Islam, I left Islam, do you think if I, if I are left those yes. who are living, yes. are yes. those who are living in the country, you're a good Jew. They are like us. Ask this question. Ask this question. So, and you'll all die for, the, for being a pastor. You you when you see the truth, yeah. when you see the truth, if you went to Ukraine, if you went to Ukraine, and you shouted, go Russia, what would happen to you? You know. Okay, so, Surah 3, Ayah 136. Hasta version says that many are prophet fought Katala okay fought Kalun and Wash versions for example say that many a prophet was killed Katala now is killed and fought the same thing or are they two different words two different meanings two different words two different meanings in two different kirat of the two different ruat actually of the Quran okay and many a prophet fought for them and many a prophet was killed. Yes. Were they fought or killed? So were the prophets fought or killed? So it says, it's translated in so different people opinion. translate the words differently. Now, okay. I say, if I say, they're two completely different the word, words, the word, though. No, no, they're no, no, two no, different no, words, two different, different meanings. We cut it. The Kill and fought are two different words. This is how the words come from. Even in Arabic, that's different words. I will go to the Bible. I will go to the Bible. This is how the words come from. There's a difference between being fought and being killed. There's a difference between being fought and being killed. There's a difference between being fought and being killed. I am going to be fought. If I say cut it, it means I'm going to kill him. There's two different Well, I would suggest that you would prefer to fight than to be killed, yeah? You would know. you prefer to you fight or would you prefer dialects. to be killed? Yeah, 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 yeah. But I don't know this. Look, as an Arabic speaker, I can tell you. If I say Anna Ekton, I'm not even on the first one. Muslim had a fight with the... Muslim had a fight with the... 284. There is a difference between killing and fighting. Muslim had a fight with the... Right, okay. Brother Ekton is making a case that 
they are different dialects. Okay. Sometimes they are okay. different yeah, different dialects. dialects. So they're not different dialects, they're different words. The so we did the way mean you it. Say it. Okay. The way you say it is different. Yeah, of course the way you say it is different. Because they're different words. Okay. That therefore they have different meanings. There is one Quran. There is one Quran. No, you don't have only one Quran. You don't only have one Quran. You don't have only one Quran. You said we use one Quran. One Quran out of how many? Who decided that one Quran? Which Quran? Which Quran is going to be you the same for you on the day of judgment? These these two Explain different Quran right, yeah. are saying different meaning. Yeah. Okay. Two different Quran are saying two different meaning. We can, we can look at another example. Is it contradicting each other? That's the question. They are. We can. Oh. Being dead and being alive are two different things. You can go to you can go to war, come back oh. being alive. If you want to see that one again? Oh. Want to see this one again? Uh, it was 346. This one wasn't it? Right, okay. It says, and how many a prophet has fought with whom they were worshippers of the Lord? So you're not become weak. So your justification, can I just clarify? It's got yeah, let let it let it is that and kill. Messiah is coming. Okay, so what, what's your what's your point? What's your point? So so the point is there are there are words with different meanings. Two okay. Quran, so it's a so it's there are different Qurans with different Quran, different meanings. There is not just one Quran. Okay. And it, and it, it also affects Everything your practice. Okay. When you, for example, if you have to miss a fast, suppose you have to miss a fast because you're ill or something like that. Yeah. Then after you finish, you have to make some compensation. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. So in Surah two uh, Bakara, okay al Bakara, yeah I O one eight four it says how many people says, sorry. how many people do you do you feed it tells you, you huh? how many people do you need to feed, feed when you cannot fast. You know sometimes you can't fast. Yeah so you need to, you, if I'm sick if I'm yeah, yeah so yeah. how many people do you need to feed each church I, don't, I can't remember the top of my head. You can't, okay. I can't remember it depends. It depends. You. It depends upon which Quran you're using. Okay. If you're using half Quran, half Quran tells you you need to feed one poor person. Okay, one poor man. Yes. If you're using wash Quran, then you have to feed many poor men. Okay. One eight four. So this is ayah. I uh, a backer, yes, uh, 184, yeah. Fasting for a limited Surah number of days, so whoever among you is ill or on a journey, then an equal number of days are made upon those who are, upon those who are able to fast, a ransom of feeding a poor person each day, another volunteer's excess is better for him to fast, but to fast is better for you. Okay. Okay. So, so depending upon, Depending upon which Quran you're using, you may have to feed one person or you may have to feed a number of poor people, okay? Yeah? So it does make a difference. Yeah? I can show you the Arabic, okay, larger, if you can read it. It's actually the photo, it's not very good, is it? Yeah. But um, and anyway. For, what does it say? And for. Wait, is it is it that And for those who can. Fast. fast of difficulty, they have to feed a poor person. person. Not poor yeah, okay, yeah. Say here. And for those who can fast with difficulty, it may affect the redemption by feeding poor men. Yeah, okay. Read the Arabic version. Arabic so, is great in the Quran. so, what does so, it say? And for those who can fast with difficulty, it may affect the redemption. Okay, so this is saying, and if you can fast with difficulty. Guys, sorry, can you move just to a couple of steps over there to background sound? It's saying, if you can fast with difficulty, yeah. so look, let's read it carefully, yeah? And for those who fast with difficulty, so if I'm ill mm. and let's say I fast, it says it may affect redemption by feeding a poor man. So, so you can buy back what you've missed, as it were, in fasting by feeding poor people, yeah? It may affect me doing what I have to repay. Yes, that's so right, yes. So that's, that's right. That's but the question is, is it, if you're using Hafs Quran, do you think that's one poor person you need to feed? For missing the fast, but if you're using Wash Quran, you have to feed many poor people. No, it doesn't say yeah. many. Well, it's it's a plural of at least three, isn't it? The Arabic there is the three plural. Okay, three or more. Yeah. Okay. You know, in Arabic you've got singular, plural, which is two, and plural, which is three or more. Yeah. Okay. So this is the three or more version of the plural. Yeah. This. So you have to feed many poor people. This is saying, and if I fast with illness. 
it may affect me having to pay, having to feed a poor person. So if I fast with illness and there's a homeless man over there, mm. it may that might affect me actually going to pay the person. This is off what you're saying. I could be this could be a wrong translation. I don't know. Yeah. But from what this is from what you're saying from here, it's just saying that I can't. Um, it's gonna affect me paying mm. a poor person if I fast if I'm ill. Because yeah. if you're ill, it's you don't have to fast. It's yeah. encouraged not to fast because it can have it can affect you. That's right. Yeah, and women having their periods and so on, it's the yeah, same yeah, kind yeah. of thing. Yeah. Periods okay. So, so the point which we're trying to make is that not all Qurans are the same. Okay. It depends on which you have, which Quran you have. Ninety something percent of Muslims nowadays are using the Hafs Quran. Okay. But some people in other parts of the world are using different Qurans. For example, you know, in North Africa, like Algeria, Tunisia, and Morocco, and so on like that, they're using Wash Quran and Kaloon Quran. Okay. Um, in uh, in Sudan, I think they're using um, Kaloon. Yeah. And the Alduri is used in Nigeria, I think. Algeria is again Wash Quran. Yeah. But there are a number of, there, it depends on where you live in the world, okay? You might be reciting a different Quran, okay? So yeah. this, so this. How many, sorry, I, I, I'm sorry, I just answer. How many people do you need to feed? From based on what I'm saying, one. I don't know. According to Hafs, it's one, but according to Wash, it's many. Like, which one I, I'm not sure. But what I can tell you is, I will do my research and I can come back and give you yeah. yeah. I, I, I don't want to go something yeah. I'm don't yeah. know it's, about. It, it's not that I'm you know, concerned yeah, that that's yeah. a wrong translation okay. or anything. The point is, I was just trying to make the point that there's not just one Quran which is exactly the same for everybody. It's, it's there are multiple dialects. Qurans, okay, dialects. which are, do I have guess, different words with different meanings. Is, next question is, how did you come to each conclusion while there are different Arabic Qurans, there are just different dialects? Because you can Muslim, use any of them, no, no, I think. No, no, question is, how did you come to that conclusion? Because Muslim scholars express, actually, they are not dialects. So yeah. why do you... So what are they if they're not dialects? They are saying different, those Qurans are not different dialects. Versions, different, different words. Quran. They are not dialects. So question is, why did you answer my brother as they are the dialects? So where did you get that information? Um, from... I'll get, I'll get you the website which says they are not the dialects. Okay? Mm -hmm. From videos I've seen, it's different dialects from uh, yeah. imams, sheikhs, they say... Imams. Yeah, that's right. So imams and sheikhs. Say, say that, say that these um, different kurat that we have in these days, okay, are just different dialects. Yeah, yeah? This is different ways of pronouncing things, or maybe, maybe diff slightly different words, but meaning the same thing. Okay, but actually, when we look at it, that's not the case. There are different words, and they have different meanings. Okay, it's not just a matter of dialect. You could be correct or, if you're based off the English translation, but the Arabic, we need to remember once again that Arabic, yeah. or Quran Arabic, is it's a very loose translation to the English. That's why sometimes when but, but, Christians come yeah. and spring a verse okay. talking about this as a contradiction yes. to that, 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 the Arabic is, it has a different meaning. What's this? So, here's the website that Islam created. They are telling us those different Arabic Qurans, which oh, you sorry. kind of identified as dialect. According to your mind, I'm guessing you are calling them Ahu. Do you call those Qurans Ahu? I'm not sure. You don't even know. Uh, uh, so according sorry, to your Muslim scholars, they are see. not. Uh, let, right. I don't it's let very small, scholars. as all. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 so. yeah. There is a way to make it. Hmm. Okay, it says, sorry, yes, okay. Some scholars <laughs> said that what was meant by Ahruf was the Ahruf is dialect, was the dialects of the Arabs, but this is far fetched because of the hadith of Umar al Khattab who said, I heard Hisham ibn Hakim reciting Surah al Furqan in a manner different from that which I used to recite it, and the way Messenger taught me to recite it. So, 
One, one second, one second. I was about to argue, I was praying, but I waited until he finished his prayer, then I tied his garment around his neck and seized it and brought it to the messenger. He said, I heard this man recited it in a way different to the way you taught it to me. Allah well, said to him, recite it, and he felt it as if I heard it. I had heard him recite the messenger. He said it was revealed like this. Then he said to me, recite it, and he said it was revealed like this. He said it was revealed in seven different ways to recite it. Okay. So, so, the Quran, it says so, the Quran is revealed in seven different ways, yeah. different dialects. So, and he's, from what That's, I know, his dialects do not contradict each other. But the strange thing is that Hisham and Umar belong to the same tribe. They spoke the same dialect. And yet Hisham and, and Umar men. were reciting it differently. And they are adult men. And Why they yeah. would they in the first place have different dialects? If you read at the yeah. end, the Quran has been revealed in seven different ways to recite in the way that is easiest for you. So yes. the reason why they are in different ways yes. is because it's a mean... seven, not seven. Yes. You've got better than 27 plus, not seven. Uh, I'm not sure yes. I'm and whatever, And whatever that was, if you read Islamic tradition, you will know that... Um, what is it? In, Uthman got rid of the different way. Uthman. 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 And, then, yeah, and then he Uthman. kept only one way. So okay. at the time of so, Uthman, Quran was one way. So I guess yeah. um, you need to come up with better response regarding why mm. there are like... So my brother brought you two references. Yes. One of them was fight versus kill. The other one is feeding one person versus feeding many two, two and more. Many and then there are like no, lots of other things. The ones for... For example, affects the different schools of people. Mm. Okay. I missed all that. Yeah. Well, how are you doing? You're right now. Yes, I'm well, thank you. What, what, what's, what's the topic of yeah, this so, session? Yeah, so, 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 no. Well, the thing was that oh. this, this gentleman said um, there's only one Quran. Yeah. And we said, we responded, no, there's not only one Quran, there are different Qurans, okay? Hash, wash, and so on, yeah? Okay? And he suggested that they were just different dialects. Different okay. translations. Or different translate. well, not different translations, because we're talking about Arabic. There's Quran, different Qurans okay. in Arabic. Hafs is an Arabic Quran, Wash is an Arabic Quran, Al Duri is an Arabic Quran, Kaloon is an Arabic Quran, and so on, yeah? They are Arabic Qurans, yeah? But they are different, okay? They have different words and they have different meanings of those words. What okay? are the 37 so different say, dialects that you said? So that's well, they're not 37 different dialects, it no. The no, no, no. Seven. Well, that's right. In that hadith, it says that Muhammad revealed or gave the gave the Quran in seven different, different ways. ways. The Aruf, whatever yes, Aruf yes, means. Yes, okay. yes. Seven different ways. Supposedly, Usman standardized the Quran into just the dialect uh, yes. of the Quraysh. So the way he okay. got it is he standardized the text. But yes. Supposedly, in the dialect so of the Quraysh. People, there were people. Yeah. The companions of the They yeah. memorized the Quran off by heart. They knew it off yes, by heart. Yes, that's right. So when they wrote so it down, Ibn Masud, Abay, Ibn Kaab, when they wrote it Asana, down, yeah. there, there's going to be mistakes. There's bound to be mistakes. So what? No, 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 no. If, if off by heart, they can, it's possible for it to be. It's possible. They can no, they, they, I, I know what he's saying. There was a Hafiz. There was Hafiz of Quran. Yes. So yeah. there's, there's bound to be mistakes if someone learns it off by heart and forgets one part, but mm -hmm. in reality, he's a different part. Okay, I would so agree with you on that. The text, I don't think and anyone who right. wanted a copy yeah. from that, he told him, if you want a copy, you have to get the master copy. And he told him the other. Yeah, to burn their versions text. of the Quran. Yeah. But that. When he standardized the text, that was the Quran. That was it. That was the Quran itself. Yeah, that's so what. There was no Quran that was burnt. Okay. It's, it's, that's right. That's why. So, so Uthman tried to standardize the Quran into just one of these arus. Okay. And he said, get rid of all the others. Get rid of any other that version one, of the Quran you down. have. Okay. Yeah. He wrote. He he, wrote, he got Zaid ibn Tabit to write down in the dialect of the Quraysh the Quran. Okay. And he ordered all the other. Bit where the whole copies or part copies of the Quran to be burned. Yes, yeah? because they were because he wanted to standardize it. So he wanted to standardize the Quran yes. just one aruf, okay? And having done that, nevertheless, there are still many different Qurans today with with different words, with different meanings, okay? And that, that, has, that has come about later, okay? Presumably late if we if we just believe what is written about Uthman, then that must have come about later. 
the, the variations came about. Why the Bible is the only book or allowed the killing of kid, kids, children? Um, it's not, it doesn't say that, sorry. I know, I know sorry. That. Yeah. Yeah. This, so, what I'm talking about. This, this I will do my research. Yes. Because I, I don't want to talk about yeah. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, okay. So it's I'll do enough. research, I'll do deep research yeah, into fair. this whole... Why the Bible is the only book fair. allowing to have killing of kids, children, I, I respect you. babies, infants. That, yeah. I'll do research. Once I'm your 15 yeah. Then, yeah. I'll come back if you heard Why the Bible? Answer, 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 answer. Thank you very much. Your Jesus has to kill babies and children, you know, slaughter them alive. Why? So, so this gentleman, um, this gentleman initially claimed there was only one Quran, but uh, when we when we showed him that there are actually different Qurans, different Arabic Qurans, um, and these different Arabic Qurans have different words in them with different meanings, um, he's concluded that it's, he needs to go away and do some research. Um, unfortunately, he just believed what his imams and sheikhs had told him that there is only one Quran, the same throughout the world, the same since the time of Muhammad. That, the idea of perfect preservation is simply not true.